Got the bovine here, about to do the first round of my next phase of Grand Arena Championships. Um, my opponent is Zalandis Gosuler. And when I first pulled up his inventory, I thought, I'm going to lose. I'm going to look at this. Two, uh, two, two you know, Relic 7s, two Relic 6. I'm like, why am I even facing this person? I, I don't stand a chance. Uh, then, um, you know, looking down... His, um, I mean, his top four are way better than my top four. But then my, the rest of my roster is better than his roster. So, um, so hopefully I can do pretty well in this. And um, so, kind of that expectation. So he put, you know, his two Relic Geos. Uh, together on a team, a defensive team. I'm just like, that, that, that's just going to be impossible to take out. But um, he was not able to, you know, he took out this group here. Boom. One battle. He was not able to do much damage to my Houndstooth. Um, so my Houndstooth hold, held. And, and then over here, um, two paddles to clear my Padme squad. And then I've recently gave, just before the, this phase started, I gave R2-D2 the uh, Zeta. And so I moved this squad up to my front line, and they just weren't able to do much against that squad. Four battles to finally clear it. And then didn't bother attacking my, my back row. So here we go. So, um, so we, uh, we've got... Down here, so we got the Geos, got the Night Sisters, and I've been thinking about what I'm going to do for the Night Sisters. They're relatively weak. Um, I could use Geos. Geos are what I normally do against Night Sisters, particularly weak Night Sisters. But that's a full Geo squad. Really, um, Poggle's ability block is really key for them, and I don't have Poggle uh, to do that. So I am think I'm going to use Grievous here. So we'll see how that goes. But right now we're going to start with Count Doku. And uh, so this could be a very dangerous squad. If he's able, if uh, Doku does the Master Makashi, um, then he he and Soldier will hide. And all I have to, you know, I have to attack Sun Fact. And then Sun Fact will eventually taunt. And I have to attack Sun Fact some more. And he's just this, you know, he's a big, slow tank really don't want to have to get through him to get to the other two. So I'm going to go and use uh, my Bastilla team. And I think, so Bastilla gives 120% tenacity. So that, that's going to be, um, keep Count Dooku from shocking and stunning my, my troops. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to do this one here. I actually looked this up last night. I didn't know this until last night. This removes 70% turn meter. And now... So now I've got him out of there. And now it's pretty easy. These guys really don't hit that hard. Um, they, they're not very fast. I mean, Geos, the big thing with Geos is that they, um, let's see. Do these guys, are these guys going to counterattack? Yeah. All right. That was a mistake. Well, not. Now we got Sunfact left. He's got... He's going to counterattack like a. See if he's stunned? No. Trap. Ow. Man. So 50, 54. Okay. Full score there. Thought Yoda was going to lose a point of protection. He didn't. All right. Opens up the fleet. See what his fleet looks like. 
one nine five. Okay. Go by separatist at him. Yep. Get short man. I guess we'll go for Gus first. I guess we won't go for Gus first. Oh. Sixty-three, nine twenty-eight. So, if Jess have to defeat the Night Sisters, um, so this is my. I want Grievous. Yeah, I'll go. We'll go with that. One option I can have is I can go with IG-88 leadership. Bump up Grievous' chance of critical hitting. He's going to go first. He's going to get a... A first attack and he couldn't wipe out all the night sisters the problem with that is that they're gonna they're gonna come back i think they're gonna come back if i i really don't know if, if grievous were to manage to kill all three night sisters at once would that be enough i don't think he can kill the the zombie though so we'll see so we'll go with the this here the the more balanced squad Okay, answers that question. Yes, if Grievous hits all three at once, they all die. That was that was quick. <laughs> okay, so I've won, and so I'm gonna go ahead and attack these guys with my geos just because I've got nothing better to do. You know, I mean, why not? I'm just gonna pro throw it on auto. Um, I'm faster than they are. I have Geo Soldier uh, attacking instead of Poggle. So Geo Soldier, he's going to crit every time he attacks, and uh, Geo Spy is going to crit every time he attacks, and also every time he does his Silent Strike. Um, Geo Soldier, when he attacks, he crits and he gets 25% turn meter. So we're we should be getting more attacks in than the other group. But the thing of it is, they've got Jess. No, oh, fifty percent more, sixty percent more health than me, and every time the GBA does the uh, the you know the respawn the health protection, boom, that rebuilds that health pool. So I don't, I think I'm gonna lose. I mean, probably the best I could hope for is timing out. That's really, I think, the best I can hope for. But you know, what the heck? Like I said, we'll, we'll throw it on here, click auto, and see what happens after five minutes. And uh, Okay, so my brute went down first. Yeah.
I had like an early lead because of my superior speed, but they're, they're just going to wear me down because they just have so much more life than me. Okay, there goes the brute. Boom. Yeah, I'm going to die. Alright, boom, 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 boom. Defeat. So, but enough to give me a little victory. And so that's Gunther Bovine. Out.